Welcome to Ron Wells Money Matters. Think carefully before spending your money. And it may might seem like basic, I'm even saying that, but trust me, especially if you want to really manage your money. Think carefully. Do you really need this? I use myself for an example. Now, anybody, especially on my, uh, you know, my main channel, you know, I've got different shirts on and some people, I, I, I always get every, I say every few weeks, I get somebody say, where did you get that shirt? Where did you get that shirt? All right. Now, I was in a store with my sons the other day and I saw a nice shirt and I thought about getting it. I was even asking them, but then I said, do I really need this? Because I got enough shirts. I think I could wear a different shirt every day for a month. Just, just even just on these videos. And I was thinking, I was like, do I really need this? Do I really, really need this? I was really thinking. I know there would have been a time I would have bought it, but you know, I was like, do I need this? Cause you know, I, people know I, you know, had a stroke a few months ago and yeah, I'm gonna keep reminding people, but I was like, you know, even with co-pays, even with the insurance, you still got co-pays. So, uh, you know, I had to deal with some of them. So it's not as much money, still got a lot of money. I still could have got the shirt, but I was like, do I really need this? And that's one thing I've, I've, I've done even before, because even, like I said, even the shirts I get, those are investments. Those are investments just to make more money with my social media assets. So anyway, <laughs> but no, I was really thinking about it. I really think, can I, can I do everything? Because one of the things, I look at uh, spending money as investments, even when I buy food. Even, even when I buy food, it was like, is this, will this bring me the right nourishment? Even if it's something, nah, ain't gonna bring me any nourishment. I just like the taste of this. I'm still thinking. You want to get in the habit of thinking carefully when you're spending your money. Because one of the things that many people do, they just spend their money willy-nilly. As the elders would say, it will burn a hole in their pocket. They just got to spend it. They spend it. They don't have savings for anything. That's because they spend, spend, spend. And I'm going to tell you what, that's, that's how a lot of people get in trouble. They don't think about what they're actually doing. You know, when you, one of the things you want to get in the habit of, especially you trying to save some money so you can A, invest it later, so you can have it for an emergency, so you can invest it, uh, so you can put it into income producing assets like mutual funds or something like that or real estate funds Whatever, but before you even get to that point you got to have it a lot of people get in trouble because they spend their money Without really thinking about it. They just spend it. They just spend it You know then shoot they know that in grocery stores. I say if you notice in grocery stores I have like the gossip magazines candies, little snacks you can eat right up front. They put them up there for a reason, right on the checkout line. They put them there for a reason. And uh, trust me, they they like, there's a couple, there's a couple stores in my area, they moving stuff around. They think about all of this. That's to get you to spend that money. And trust me, they make a lot of their money, whether it's these stores and stuff, uh, even clothing stores, grocery stores, gro uh, uh, groceries, grocery stores, clothing stores, whatever, by putting stuff where you might just pick it up. You might just pick it up. You spend your money without thinking about it. Shoot, even at, uh, when I was working retail, we used to have chocolates right on the uh, counter and stuff. And that, and that, after I left a few years ago, they had stopped doing that, but it wasn't working for them. But that's how they're thinking. See, but when you have money, if you start thinking beforehand, all of a sudden you start saving, you can put that money away. Like the only things you need to, you have to spend your money on, you gotta spend it on your rent, mortgage, um, any insurances. And even um, even uh, like some of the extras, like I, I have like some streaming services, mainly for my sons. Now, if it was just me, 
Well, if it was just me, I'd probably be living in like some, uh, if it was just me, I would honestly live in like uh, efficiency, but that's another conversation. You know, one of the reasons I got a bigger place was so my sons could have a room each. But I thought carefully even before doing that. Like think carefully, every single thing. Like when you're spending money on a car, like when I got my car, like, like I say, it was a used car. It didn't even have 7,000 miles on it. Didn't even have 7,000 miles. I thought carefully. Yeah, I could have got something new. I could have got something new and expensive easily, but I was just like, is that really what I need? You know, I know how much I drive. I'm like, well, I don't really need that. So I thought carefully. And, you know, just, I was able to pay it off. I paid it off in a year. Could have actually paid it off like when I first got it, but I wanted to leave money in my savings. So, but still, I, I was like thinking carefully. You think carefully about everything you spend money on. Think carefully. Is this worth it? You know, when you, before you get that shirt, is it worth it? Before you get those clothes, is it worth it? Like I say, when I get clothes, it's really, most of the clothes I get now, our investments for what I'm doing online or if I'm doing a public event or something like that. Otherwise, I wear like the cheapest things I can find because I'm thinking about it. <laughs> I'm thinking about, it. yeah, I look just regular, regular, like just driving around just in the neighborhood and stuff, you know? Like I don't wear my polos or um, Lacoste. I don't wear that out in this neighborhood. Yeah, because, but, there for business. And even then, I thought carefully about them. I didn't pay full price for them. I got them from outlet malls. Like, you also want to think about carefully where you get stuff, how you get stuff. Because, and I learned that working retail, actually for one of the customers, he, I don't know if he was a millionaire, but he had a lot of money. He, he had a lot of money, even people couldn't tell. But he would he was he would just shop clearance. He would never buy he would never buy anything like uh, even on sale. He hit the clearance racks. He would spend his money like very intelligently. I learned a lot from him, just talking with him. And that's the one of the things you want to do. You want to think carefully. Think carefully. You know, don't just spend your money willy nilly. Every single thing, like you want to, every I mean every single thing, even that candy. It was like, do you really need that candy bar or that shirt or particular products? You know, that's one of the reasons why I like, okay, like even going to the grocery store. I usually go every day to get something. I don't like having, I don't like having uh, leftovers because there's a few things I got. I've had to throw out some things because I wasn't using it like that. Because even, even like some like condiments or something. I get the smallest I can find if I had to use it, then find a way to use it. But seriously, it's you, you want to think carefully because you want to get in that habit of spending your money in an intelligent manner. That way you can save money. That way you can take that saved money because I'm always emphasizing that you can take that saved money and then you can, you can get it into mutual funds, uh, maybe money markets, uh, real estate funds, stuff like that. And then you could still build up money just for a business and then an emergency. You can still build up for just a basic emergency. You don't want to live paycheck to paycheck. So it's like, but to get to that point, you got to think every single time how you spending your money. All right, just get, to, just get in that habit, all right? So anyway. That's all I have. Y'all know the deal. Let's go make that money. <laughs>